Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa and I'm the owner of SeasonAndServeBlog.com. I am back again with another video in my holiday series and today we are decorating another Christmas tree in my house and we are going to be transforming this plain old pre-lit artificial green Christmas tree into this stunning traditional Christmas tree with all of the classic colors for Christmas. I'll be walking you through the entire process of decorating my Christmas tree from adding my lights and ribbon to adding my floral picks and of course my ornaments. Red, gold and green are the colors that are featured in this style of Christmas tree and we're keeping it really traditional with ribbon, some pine cones and some unique Christmas ornaments. So if you want to see how I decorated my traditional Christmas tree, just keep on watching. Alright, so we are beginning with a plain old artificial green Christmas tree. This tree actually comes pre-lit with lights, but I always like my Christmas trees to glow, so I am going to add more Christmas lights to this. But I'm not adding any old Christmas lights to my tree. I am adding these lights from a brand called Twinkly that are LED and you can actually change all the different colors and patterns of them. They are super cool. I showed you guys this in my last Christmas tree decorating video when I did my pearl and crystal Christmas tree and I just think it's the coolest thing. So I went ahead and customized my lights to create this really nice glowing effect and all I did was just nestle the Christmas lights into the center of the tree like so and my tree totally glows from the inside out. It is absolutely amazing and beautiful. Now that we have our lights on, we're going to add our ribbon and for this traditional Christmas tree, I'm using this beautiful dark red velvet ribbon and whenever I buy a ribbon for my Christmas tree, I always make sure that it's wired on the edges so that you can bend it and manipulate it as you need. So all I'm doing is starting from the top and I'm just wrapping the ribbon around the Christmas tree. So as I wrap the ribbon around the tree, I made sure to angle it towards the bottom right hand side of the Christmas tree so that I didn't have straight lines of ribbon going around the Christmas tree. As you can see here, that is what I have going on. So when I stepped back, I went ahead and adjusted that to make sure it was a little bit more angled. Also when I was looking at the tree, the red ribbon was nice but it seemed a little bit plain. So I decided to add in this gold mesh sparkly ribbon underneath it just to bring in a little bit more glam and make the traditional Christmas tree look a bit more festive and more fun. So I just went ahead and added this to the Christmas tree and it didn't take too long at all. I just lifted up the red ribbon and nestled the gold ribbon underneath it. So after adding the gold ribbon all the way down the tree, I really liked how it looked and then I moved on to adding my picks to the Christmas tree. So keeping with the traditional theme, I wanted to add some red berries and I have a combination of some bright red berries and some darker berries. And then I also have some gold sparkly picks as well. These picks are very messy. There were sparkles everywhere after this, but they really helped to pick up the light and really make the tree glow. So I went ahead and nestled the berries and the gold picks throughout my Christmas tree. So at this point, I thought the tree was looking really great on its own, but of course we can't forget our ornaments. So I added on all of these and I began with my red ornaments, then worked my way into the gold ornaments and then the green ornaments at the very end. And when I hang my ornaments, I really like to work with one color at a time, just so I can make sure I can get all of the ornaments evenly spaced throughout the Christmas tree. So once I had my red, gold, and green ornaments on the tree, I just added in a few more unique ornaments that kind of had that more traditional theme, as well as some little sprigs of pine cones with a little bit of white snow on them. 
And now for some final touches. At this point, there were sparkles all over the ground and pieces of the Christmas tree as well. So I went ahead and vacuumed all those up. And then I'm putting on my tree skirt. And this tree skirt is absolutely beautiful. I got it from Crate and Barrel. And it's a really nice knitted material and it's a light cream color. And even though it's light cream, it does have the traditional feel and I think it looks great. Now time for the big reveal. And this is how my traditional Christmas tree turned out. I'm absolutely in love with the traditional red, gold, and green color scheme. It is so festive and really makes it feel like Christmas is on its way. And as a bonus, I wanted to show you my sideboard and how that turned out. And I added these beautiful sparkly gold reindeer with some Christmas trees and my favorite candle for this season, my Cordova Candle Company winter scented candle. This candle smells like Christmas. It has cranberry, frosted juniper, and pine, and I really love it. I also added in a little music box that my mom gave me. This has little animals on it and it turns, it is the cutest thing ever. So I decided to add that to my sideboard as well. I hope that you enjoyed today's video and don't forget that if you did, please hit the like button down below as well as the red subscribe button for more Christmas decorating videos like this one. I also have lots of other Christmas decorating videos here on my channel including this beautiful one of my pearl and crystal Christmas tree. I've done a bunch of different styles and designs in the past so make sure you check that out and I will leave my Christmas decorating playlist linked in the description box below. Also make sure to check me out on Instagram for more holiday decorating inspiration as well as my food blog for lots of delicious holiday recipes. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.